Without big gongs and no need to be so fussy that there must be 12 gongs or more. Only six more gongs and a drum player keep the rhythm echo across the whole mountain area of Trap Village in Krong Anna district. Due to the tradition of the ADB ethnic, the girls became the best choice to teach gongs, thus inheriting and creating the sound of deep and simple gongs. It's different from other places. Girls are taught how to play the gong at a young age. It's difficult to learn, but we try our best. We often learn in small groups to contribute ideas to make a rhythm. The uniqueness of the ADB gongs is not only that they are played by women, but also in the performances, as the gong women's team move in a circle from right to left in an anti-clockwise direction. This dance implies a sense of gratitude to the ancestors. This female gong team in the village has existed for a long time. We have passed from generation to generation to preserve the traditional value of the people. According to statistics, the ADB people in Daglak only have about 100 houses, with nearly 1,000 inhabitants living mainly in the basins of the Krong Anna River. Local authorities have always created favorable conditions to preserve the beauty of the village's gong.